So, hello everyone, here to have a new anime then. First impression here, we actually saw one review of Sejano Marokawa Bano Desu. Um, omnipotent, magic, science, saint kind of thing. Um, the premise, I mean, I haven't seen it already, but the premise, right, is that it's like Isekai, she got summoned, but also someone else, and the person is even stronger. She can just be like, oh, whatever, like he's AFK and have like a nice knife in this fantasy world. She's gonna have like a shop or something. But I'm guessing, of course, she's probably powerful, right? You know, she's probably like, I'm just gonna run my own uh, store or something. And she's probably like incredibly good at it. And she's probably actually the stronger Isekai character, right? Um, but I think it's focused on Otome, right? More, probably more. Bitch audio, focus on some romance, some shoujo stuff. I guess so. So I'm anyway, let's start watching it. It's gonna happen. So three, two, one, and go. And yeah, see how it goes. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. A dark. It's always a hot redhead, so. It's starting out good. It starts good. Okay. Okay, it turns kind of monster demon, I guess. Hmm, now this mist turned into like a demon, right? Here we go. Some venom looking. Well, I guess they're gonna summon the Isekai cat then to defeat this like dragon or whatever up here, right? It's probably Tokyo. It's like a hard working lady here, I guess. Yeah, like saying midnight, you know, kind of like. This feels very clear. It feels like the other end, but yeah, the, the, you know, Ishiki, whatever John's called now again, it's like hard life, you know, Japanese society, you know, you, gotta, you, know, you get Isekai, you can have a nice romantic, um, you know, shield life in the other world, <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, like, it's that kind of story that she's like, oh, I'm almost, she's working like 10 hours every day at least, right? Like 15 hour work days. But then she gets Isekai to, of course, uh, fantasy lad that she can just relax and have a nice life, right, you know? <laughs> Definitely like that. Here we go. She is a kind. Did the person die now? Solving her? Yeah, that's the only girl too, right? So two girls there. They like they got a double Isekai, he's a bonus girl. Yeah, here we go. It's probably romantic. It's probably a love interest. Come on. Hot redhead. Man, I feel this is very like Bishaw. <laughs> Suddenly, the attractive hero princess like you is my sign. Yeah, I will. Hi! Yeah, you know, some hot redhead guys like, yes. I guess the mice might as well turn into it then. That they summon cute girls from Earth to fight or something. Because that's like, the, that's the strategy, man. I've done the same thing. Summon a holy maiden from Earth right, to fight this evil. And she just happened to get like her neighbor. <laughs> like, why is she summoned for? I hope it's like a stupid reason. It's just her neighbor. It's like the next girl or her childhood best friend or something. But yeah, I mean, the prince immediately took the other girl. <laughs> Yeah, the priest immediately told him, he's like, <laughs> took. Yeah, we need two girls, so it is there. You, you, you definitely need it, my young lady. How do I get home from my work? <laughs> my, uh, sort of, uh, <laughs> She's very likely stuck there, of course, in this, uh, this world. 
And his love interest. Pretty boy as well. There's a lot of pretty boys. Come on. So no Tom. Uh, I want to work. He's a workaholic, right? I mean, she wants to go home and work, right? She's like, super into her office life, right? I mean, he's pretty after all. She's gonna be like, yeah, fine. <laughs> he's kind of attractive. <laughs> he's kind of a hottie, so I guess. Get some coffee, get some tea, you know, cookies. But she has some kind of power, right? Because she was some man. She said some magic with that. <laughs> yeah, but the prince was like, oh, what a beautiful lady! And takes the order from her. Got it, got it. Come on, what, what, what about me, man? I'm a pretty lady too. Uh, I can feel her pain here. Just course it through the anime. It's a net to raise the kind of anime, what it is. She wanted to be Rimmer and Sama, but she didn't get it. Nah, she can leave it for free. Nice. Sorry for summoning you, you can leave it at office for free. Yeah, it's like, sorry, <laughs> sorry about that, but you know, you can kind of leave it at the. But she has some power, but she, she's probably more powerful than the other girl. I guess there was no reason to throw the girl whatsoever. <laughs> she's getting bored, I see, I see, it's a life of boredom, I get it, I get it, yeah, it's too easy now. Her life is like, oh, I, they, give, they give me food, I don't have to work, I can live free. Yeah, there's no TV, yeah, she's bored. She's medieval time, you're, you're a rich medieval girl suddenly. I guess an escort. You need some, you know, knight to protect her, she's a young maiden, you need some... Yeah, she's just like, oh, I'm happy to be here now. There's nothing to do. <laughs> no work to do. And it's, yeah, no books, no TV, no internet. He's like, yeah, okay, I guess I'm just gonna hang out here in the. She's stuck in this beautiful fantasy world, at least. That's always something, right? Cool castles and beautiful gardens and everything. Well, suspiciously opened uh, garden door here, or gate, or door, 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 gate. Beautiful flowers, of course. Well, at least you can, like, you know, enjoy the garden, yeah, enjoy the landscape. This could be a love interest. Come on, a pretty, yeah, oh, look at this guy, a pretty garden boy. Oh, he's gonna be loving me to look at this guy. He's a, like a nice, uh, yeah, a nice uh, landscaper guy. Oh yeah, pretty face, green hair, like he's a special hair color, you know, special hair color. Oh, he's clearly, he might be the prince brother, you know, like the, con yeah, he might be something else royal. Maybe a doctor, he's talking about medicine here. Hmm. It's like a medicine doctor. I mean, a game here. Yeah, like, wait a minute, it's like a video game? Yeah, his job is a kind of apothecary guy. He's very pretty, though. I mean, he's clearly, this is here, Romance, Romance, uh, clearly one of her love interests, come on, he's super attractive, him and the prince, right? Nice, he's got an old mural kind of thing, and he's like... I think she's gonna start working as a kind of... She's gonna run to kind of, I think she's gonna run like an apothecary, it's like cute girl on a apothecary, and <laughs> it's like, yeah. I think she's gonna run some kind of store or something and sell potions or, you know, yeah, or be like a doctor or something. She's gonna do something like that, right? 
Because she's bored, mostly. <laughs> she's bored. Like, I don't know. I need to have a job to do. And she's bored of my mind. She's like... Okay. And someone sinister looking at them. Maybe. Or she's the only pretty boy. I'm not sure happy at least because it was interesting seeing all the Porsche and stuff. Also like made best friend here. Yeah, she's like, you're happy now, girl. Met a cute boy, maybe? A boyfriend, yeah? Is it... Yeah, I'm into the research uh, place. Yeah, there are a lot of um, plants over there. But yeah, it's very short you. They're all very pretty. They're all very attractive. <laughs> I feel they're all these yes, all these men are very, very quite charming. All of them. Beautiful long man with brown hair, beautiful eyes. Yeah, they're all very charming. There you go. It's gonna be a researcher. I wanna work here, guys. Yes. I will be an Isekai researcher. Good to have a girlfriend there, man. He doesn't know he has a girlfriend, but clearly he has a girlfriend. More or less. Hmm. Yeah, they like. <laughs> so you get some, some of them on They're kind of, they are like kind of guilty. They're like, sorry for summoning you here. You, you know, we got the job for you. If you want to be a potion girl, yeah, whatever, do do it. Yeah, they're, they're like, sorry, girl, but we don't need you. So, yeah, yeah, go and do potions. They're like, sorry for like kidnapping you to this uh, fantasy world. Um. But, um, I was, I was wondering if you're gonna see what the other girl is doing. Like, if she's out fighting dragons, whatever. You know, you know I'm wondering if, if it's gonna be something about her at all. Like, the other summon person might be out, like, being badass, throwing. I don't know, you know. But I was thinking she has, this, this main character should have some powers, right? Like, she gets into this, like, gaming fantasy world and she has, like, nothing, she has no skills. Okay, now she did say the clothing, and now she's more into, yeah, now she's getting into a more. I guess fifteen clothing here. So cat cat can use her. Yeah. It's like hmm. nice. it's clearly a romance anime, definitely. How do you get magic? There's no magic in this world. I could you have magic, like what? No arm, what magic? It's like oh no. 
<laughs> Wait, no one touched the magic? No, I'm just, I, just, I, I was born here, man! Okay, she's so finally has a magic here. Is she like a super genius magician, somehow? It's a lot of work doing one potion, definitely. <laughs> it's like we're gonna do this thing and then. Uh, yeah, it's like, okay. Really? You can't use magic? Can't you also use magic yourself? Okay, let's see. Ooh, look at that. Let's hold hands together, cute girl. His hands are so firm and madly. Come on, it's like. Like he's envisioning his anime being like, oh, yeah. Is she gonna be like powerful now? I mean, I imagine her magic actually being very, very powerful, right? When she actually used magic, and because I mean, she was summoned, right? She's an Isekai OP character, right? Well, she was summoned after all, so you use a good sensei. Right, this is definitely gonna explode out. It could be a bucket goal, definitely. She will have too much magic power, right? She's gonna have too much magic power, and this is, she will like probably blow up the whole billy, probably. She will probably accidentally, you know, smash the whole place, right? Most likely, I think. Come on, exactly. She has. Oh, look at this yin yang kind of two flames here. Oh yeah, how much, how much mana do I have actually? Yeah, how much? This is like 10 points, 10 points, and he didn't even explain to me how much I should do. <laughs> He's like, wait a minute, you're destroying the place if you do more, right? Does she get tired using that magic? I mean, I guess maybe of once, but I suppose it costs like mana points, right? From that, so you, you, you expand your magic probably after you sleep afterwards, right? I don't know, but I mean. As I, I suppose it's more like a typical game, right? You kind of put in your potion, and then you do that, and then it gets like, you know, mana. It costs like 10 mana points or whatever, right? Um, I suppose you watched that. And you like, okay, so the moon is like next to the planet or something. <laughs> like, what? What? What was that? Um, yeah, she's like crafting a lot of potions now. Yeah, like you have a lot of mana on you. It's probably a lot better, right? Like it crack. It's like you're amazing. You're the best girl ever. Yeah, it's very gamey now. All the potion heals 1.5 more health points. Okay, what? 50% better health points. Nah, it's the same color. Why don't you do that bigger? It's probably all the herbs though. Oh, and more reddish. Sugoi! Okay, so they're pretty bad this place then. Can't even make a medium potion. <laughs> you have a lot of luck points! <laughs> ah, 50% or whatever time, a lot of luck there! But how do they actually do any riches here? I don't see any riches being done. They're just like mixing up the herbs and like they can't make different than one potion, they can't make like even medium potion. And they're just talking about like, you know, explosive poison or whatever, or I don't know, healing poison. It's just like, we all we only can make one potion. Not a very good uh, riches place. Well, this might be the other girl then, out fighting or whatever. She's supposed to be the warrior, right? Oh, been three months already? Yeah, because she's a Isekai character, right? She has infinite mana. What? Yeah, it's my, does, does she really have all this, you know, merchandise? Like, does she have the resources? resources? Yeah, get the healing potions. It's people are at war or whatever. 
The magic, the older girl might be in your right. Like the older main character. We gotta heal them with our potions. Don't they have like healing magic in this world? I don't know. I feel potion is more something you can uh, have on your journey, right? And then you go home, you have like a healing character that can heal you. I don't know. It's like, I guess this world doesn't have healing magic. They have like healing potions only. Very weird. But whatever. No, it's been like, wouldn't they maybe have some kind of, you know, cleric or whatever? Actually, in something on there. They lost to like a dragon lizard thing here. Wow, come on. Not even a real dragon, but losers, right? So they are all doing something with them, but they look more like medics than actual healers. And, um, problematic fantasy world. Problematic fantasy world, they don't have normal healers. They use like medics. <laughs> yeah, they use like, oh, these like, they use, like doctors then. Why don't they don't have healing mag for? Your weapons to the other girl, what happened? Okay, she can use healing mag. He seems to be too much into the other girl, right? Yeah. She can actually use healing magic. Like. So now she's gonna use, of course, her healing magic, right? Her personal potion for their captain. And he's a pretty boy too. Oh, the Danshu Melodas, here he comes. You know, blonde guy. Oh yeah, he's another pretty boy. He's gonna fall in love with her too now. You see, saves uh, her him with her special high graded. Oh, look at him, he's a pretty blonde boy, man. This guy is like, a, what a what a boy, what a pretty boy, man. This is definitely a pretty boy anime, here we go. Of course, this is even stronger than a normal high potion. And this is her, you know, special, super empowered high potion, right? This will obviously save his life here. She might kiss him now, using the classic, like, but if I kiss him with my potion in his mouth, might be a strategy. Yeah, and he's even shining, that's how powerful her potion is. <laughs> yeah, he's even glowing with her powerful potion, right? This is an amazing healing potion. Oh my god. And he's all pretty too, so. It's like, whoa. Blue eyes, blonde hair, it's like a Swedish guy, come on. And he sees her face, and he's like, what a young lady that saved me. Yeah, yeah, now he's like, oh yeah, come on, here we go. He's gonna be like, young miss, I owe you my life. When you are son. Of course, a friend with other pretty boy. <laughs> this is my old best friend. Of course, she is. Of course, she is. She's gonna chase her to horror now. She's like four or five boyfriends now. Look at this girl. She's surrounded by pretty boys. Yeah, yeah this is definitely an Otome. <laughs> She's surrounded by pretty boys. They're all like, oh, you saved my best friend. This video is exactly 50% more effective. I don't know why they're even wondering. Isn't she the Isekai? She clearly the science, right? No, but why else would it be? She's clearly the Isekai character. Did they know the Isekai her? I don't know why they're questioning this thing. They know the Sobbent from Earth, right? It's like, why are they even questioning? Why are they like, hmm, I wonder how she can do it? Like, why, how. Could she maybe have potential? Like, you know she's potential! You're so into this world! I mean, it's like, what? Come on, man. Well, open his eye, man. That was a pretty boy moment. Oh, yeah. That's like all green and shiny. And looks at her with his eyes. 
What's that scene? He has a like pretty. Oh, there it is. Oh, look at that. He's like a blonde. He's like a blonde guy, you know, with like blue eyes. Yeah, sta you, know, you know, sky blue eyes and everything. <laughs> oh, this is definitely an anime about a girl with a lot of boyfriends. Yeah. Most certainly. Most certainly, everyone. Most certainly. Um. I feel it's strange in the end, honestly. I'm just like, why are they so questioning her? Her, I mean, it is, I mean, I mean, it's one thing they would question, like, how is she doing it? If they were like, how can she make the potion better? What's her trick? Can we, you know, learn that trick? Can we manage? Can we master her abilities? That's one thing, right? But it seems to be more focused on that. Maybe she has a special talent. It's like, well, yeah, obviously you summoned her from Earth. She's an Isekai protagonist. I mean, of course, protagonist, but they know in this case. I mean, in some animes, right, you, you, know, you get summoned, no one knows it, except in, uh, like, uh, Rimaru. You watch Earth Day. In Rimaru, he gets summoned, right, but, I mean, no one else. Well, I mean, the armor cats later on, but the, but the, the normal cats, right, like Sean or whatever, they don't understand he's, like, summoned from another planet, right? They don't, they don't get that, right? You know what I mean? Um, they don't understand that. And you know, in some Isekai animes, like in example in Honsuki, they kind of reveal later and so on, right? Uh, but this anime here, they all use straight up knows that she is summoned to be this legendary warrior, right? Uh, to be this, like, you know, important woman, holy maiden to save them, right? That's like her destiny. They know that. So I feel like a weird thing that they're like, like hmm, maybe she has special uh, Noriokos, yeah, special talent that we can, uh, that she has for some reason, it's like, I mean, for some reason, that, yeah, that, that, that was strange. Like, I mean, if I was the Dory characters, I'd be like, oh yeah, she has uh, special healing potions. That's one of her talents, clearly, right? I wouldn't like question it. I'd be like, yeah, it makes sense because she's summoned to be this holy maiden. So of course she's holy, beautiful maiden. Of course she has better healing powers, you know, better healing potion powers. And then the other woman had better healing magic, right? So yeah, it makes, it makes sense that this one woman then has better. Healing potions, right? When I mean, she crafts stuff, it's better. Like, yeah, why not? Quite. So I wouldn't like crush. I, would be, I, I always accept it. I'd be like, yeah, you know. Uh, but anyway, uh, the episode was pretty. It was pretty good. It wasn't like super. Not super happened. It's clearly feel like a mixture. You know, it's a kind of you know horror anime, right? You know, Otome horror. And she has six, seven boyfriends, right? And it has that going for it. But on the same time, it's some kind of like uh, relaxing the Ishiki, whatever that. Whatever it's called, the genre, which kind of like, eh, I just kind of you know have a re relaxing life working with this thing, you know. So it is a mixture of that and a horror man, Otome horror, you know, girl horror, yeah, uh, one woman, many suitors, right? Uh, definitely, I think especially immediately because it starts with her having this, you know, like she works overtime, she comes home at like midnight, you know, something like that. She she's like works the whole day, right, ten plus hours every day. She has no friends, I guess, no boyfriend, whatever, right? And uh, she comes home and is like, oh, I'm so lonely. Uh, you know, no one's there for me, right? It's kind of like the same, you know, you see no damage, right? Kind of like the, um, oh, it's Carlo again, the guy that turns into the slime former guy. Uh, oh, it escapes my mind on that anime. Slime, 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 something former. Yeah, whatever. He had the exact same, you know, um, uh, exact same, but he had a very similar backstory. He worked overtime, and his his mother had um, had uh, passed away. So after she passed away, he's just coming home to his you know lonely apartment. No one is there, right? He's like, oh, I hate my life. I wish I was, you know. Like she she's very similar, right? You know, like she just kind of works all day long. She has no pets. She has no you know boyfriend, no romance, no family, right? He's like, oh, I wish my life. yeah. So very similar, I think, background. You know, overworked. Uh, yeah, too hard work life, right? And now she's like happy in this fantasy, beautiful fantasy world. She still works very hard, though. I suppose she kind of works hard, I guess, like production-wise. But I suppose it's still more like she kind of works, and yeah, I guess she's fine. I guess she kind of just this is fun, right? And then of course she's gonna save all these pretty boys and get some kind of Otome harem going on here, right? And she has like seven, or eight guys that wants her. She has to pick. Who she love it, right? And they're all very pretty. Like, oh, he's a guy with beautiful blonde eyes, blonde, you know, shiny blonde hair. He's a guy with, you know, pretty boy with green hair. 
it's a guy with like a long, you know, uh, muscular long man with long hair. And, you, know, you know what I mean? The prince, I guess, as well. And the red, you kind of the aggressive redhead kind of, you know. So they're all different, uh, you know, types, right? They're all different types. It's very, it's very, it feels very textbook. It's like, it's like 10 boys and they're all different. Right? One, one is aggressive and redhead and angry and, you know, very impulsive. One is like calm and collected. One is very kind of aloof, I guess. It's going to be, it's clearly going to be the death, right? Um Anyway, will I watch more of the anime? Maybe, maybe not. I always say it felt uh, it felt very slow, of course. Because I think it's always a problem for these kind of animes. They always kind of like you sit there, and you kind of just watch it. it I, I don't think they, they worked that well as a reaction or a review format. I suppose. I think that's at least like an anime for a YouTube channel or YouTube Twitch one. Um, that I do feel with these kind of animes, they're a little bit like you kind of watch them and you feel like I could review this. If I saw the whole system right, but it, not much happened really. One episode here, it really did. Like she, she gets summoned. We know it's not a girl there, right? She gets the the, the, the the prince in the beginning, and yeah, then she just learns how to do potion and saves a guy, you know. But I mean, I could summarize that that's basically the plot. Right? She gets Ixikai, uh, No one, they don't need her because it's like two characters. Uh, she learns, to, she likes to do potions, improves level three months, and then saves a pretty boy, right? Uh, like that's that's the episode storyline. It's very very little actual story happening here, right? So it's uh, I think I felt the same things with the slime anime. Like it it happens very little per episode in this kind of genre usually. Uh, but maybe it's the first episode. So it, might, it might be a lot more uh, engaging later. Uh, but compared to Bakarina, you know I love Bakarina. Bakarina one of the best animes I think. And Bakarina though, it's also of course an autumn anime, you know, horror and just boyfriend and girlfriend. But in that anime, I mean, it's very, very funny. You know, it's a lot of action, it's a lot of comedy. This here I felt, well, it wasn't that funny, I guess. Yeah, like, I think that's a problem I think I have with this kind of slice of doing nothing life animes. That I love, you know, I'm a huge fan of slice of life, right? You know, non non and so on, new games, right? I like that genre a lot, Gentrick and so on. Um, and this genre, I feel, I mean, it has the romance, you know, the romance, one, you know, one woman trying to find love, right, as a general plot as well. But per episode here, it is probably going to be this uh, kind of sitting, relaxing, you know, not much happening. Um, it's going to have that relaxed uh, life kind of anime, right? And I think the problem with that, in my opinion, is, is that even it's very similar, I think, right, to like a new game or whatever. Like he's kind of living a life and he's working or whatever, and it's kind of you know, you have friends and it's kind of nice. But the problem again that I, I think, in my opinion, is that those other animes, like I mentioned, they are so much more funnier. Like they have so much more comedy, so I can really laugh and really enjoy them. And here I feel like, I mean, it was okay, but I, I really do feel you could have summarized this plot in like five minutes in the anime. You know, like it's like ten minutes. Where I feel nothing really happens. It's, it's a very slow burn, um, and uh, even, it's even. If, but the thing is that you can watch an episode like New Game and literally nothing happens with the plot stream. I mean, like nothing happens. Uh, a robot works. Yeah, you know, like nothing actually happens with the actual production or the romance or the, you know, basically nothing actually like involves the characters. But the thing is that the, it can be twenty minutes of hilarious laughter. You have twenty minutes of like really really funny comedy. Here I've like. Okay, nothing much happens for like roughly tens of minutes, or kind of like it's kind of it's kind of there, uh, but they weren't that funny either. I guess they're kind of romantic, but I but I think the problem here is that I'm actually not super in. I don't think they really built up these uh, boys that were her boyfriends. You know what I mean? They didn't. Really, I mean, I guess just ended here with him waking up though. She healed him. So, but still, I don't think they really built up like what's the difference between. You know, green-haired guy, brown-haired guy, and blonde guy, whatever. Red guy is clearly like a very rash, reckless guy. So he's kind of, we understand he's red and reckless, you know, classic red, 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 red girls, right? You know what I mean? So we kind of get that, right? He's probably Sundar and so on. We get that, you know, we get that, fine. But uh, those two characters, like, we don't really get enough, I feel, about them. Maybe this is better than a novel. Maybe the author more explains their, you know, their different personalities and so on. I don't feel they have so much to go on. The difference here between like the director and you know the assistant guy like who, who yeah they're both attractive you know from, like they're very beautiful but i don't really get like okay they, they seem to have kind of the same personality or, or like more not really built up yet so i really yeah i don't know but i felt the episode really didn't explain their characters that well that's probably gonna come more of course later but i could i can see that the, the novel is probably more explaining how they act and what they like and, and what and why she's interested in them yeah i don't feel really built up 
why they are attractive, except just like physically they're attracted, right? Well, personality wise, so being nice to her. So, so I don't know. I'm a little bit like, hmm. Yeah, I, yeah, I don't know. I felt that was kind of, it's kind of, it's kind of a mediocre of the episode one, honestly. And they didn't really explain the world either. Okay, so the other girl can like heal stuff. How does magic work? She seems to have like infinite mana points, I guess, but they didn't really explain how that works either. Like they didn't really explain how much mana you you burn every time you use a potion, or how like the problem is that if they have, if he has said I can only make ten potion per day, and he's like oh I can make two thousand right, then we have oh shit she can make so much more. He's like you can make a lot of potions, but he didn't explain you know what is the average uh, volume potion or what how he can do and so on. So that's kind of strange too. It didn't explain the system at all the melee system. So that that must be the weak as well in my opinion. Because it was, yeah, like I didn't really build up how he or how she compares to the other persons. We can just assume that she's better, but it's not really explained how. Uh, or how, I mean, like, difference is not explained. So that's strange, too. The more I think about the episode, the more I'm just like, wait a minute. <laughs> but yeah, that's my first impression, guys. Let's go with that. Put the like button. Uh, tomorrow, we have some more new enemies, right? If I have time, I do want to kind of catch up to the Hig uh, that was uh, yesterday. Well, yeah, tomorrow we have uh, this guy in some kind of really hardcore game. That sounds fun though. Kyo Kyo Shinka Shita Full Life. That's like a really funny comedy anime. That's probably my type of I like more. That anime sounds a lot more funnier. Also, sucking at virtual reality, but it sounds really funny. Super Cab, a cute girl, Stone Viking. Seven Deadly is going. And then on two days, there's Zombieland Sega. Yeah, and also. We have Zombieland Sega, and we have uh, uh, what can I call it? Yeah, Demon, How to Demon Lord on Thursday, right? It's gonna be a good t Thursday, a strong day there. Um, but yeah, I don't know. It's kind of one of those things. The more I think about the anime, the less I'm like, wait a minute, what's happening here? Uh, <laughs> yeah, hmm. 